The Yamaha Viking comes with a 50-year heritage of build quality, dependability, and reliability. And let's be totally fair, that's just as true for Honda. But the Vikings engineers went out of their way to make sure it was just as easy to service as it is to operate. The pioneers a bit more work, starting with engine access. On the Viking, you just lift up the cargo bed, and there it is. Pioneer's boat is under the seats, and it's a lot more cramped. The Viking's air filter is right here under the seat, and it's easily removed without tools. Here it is on the Pioneer. You've got to squeeze yourself under the cargo bed to get at it, and you're going to need a screwdriver to get it out, and it's smaller. Which one do you think is more able to handle a dusty worksite? to say nothing of letting the engine breathe. The oil filter on the Viking is right here, and it's a no-tools spin-on design. The Pioneer's is way down here, and you'd better have a wrench handy. And the Pioneer's battery is located down here, where it's more exposed to the elements. The Viking's is right up here, under the hood, up high, safe and protected. And speaking of protection, just look at these CV boot guards on the Viking, and lack thereof on the Pioneer. Plus, the Viking's full underbody skid plate makes it nearly invulnerable to rocks and other stuff that can get up into the machine. The Pioneer? Not so much. Two capable machines, two highly respected manufacturers. But when it comes to serviceability and dependability, the Viking comes out on top. <laughs>